Hi everyone, Amy Love here, and I am here to share with you my very first ever, um, what is it called again? Paper bag <laughs> mini album. And I want to thank uh, Kim from Angel Dream Crafts and Kathy and Shannon and Mary all for their inspiration as we've all been working on these lately. And how much fun was this? And I decided to break into my tilde paper hoard. But, you know, that was very hard for me. And I used one of my favorite um, tilde pads, which I don't remember the name of right now. Of course I don't. But that's what's all over the front, except um, this dyed uh, doily that I cut up and put in the background. I actually got from my kit that I bought from A Trace of Sparkle, and I will put a link to her channel below. I got a great pack of some pink dyed papers and envelopes and doilies and tags, and there's a couple of the tags in here too. So I, I did uh, use some of those. I, of course, stickled up the images. I put the uh, welcome flag from the paper pad. I just popped it up on some foam dots and I made a bunch of these little tiny paper button uh, bows that I love uh, using um, the little bow die that I have. And I added some cotton trim. It's tied together with this adorable ribbon. This is just so cute. I love how this turned out. I wish that my camera would focus better, but you know, the focus issues are real. So here is the uh, first page and in the cover, I made um, a pocket right here that has um, some tags in it with some white, you know, fuzzy fiber, cause yes, it's too cute. Another one of these little tiny bows and you know, a place where you can journal. Then on this page, I used the, some of the, um, little tilde embellishments I made recently on a video and I turned them into little tuck spots and this is one of the uh, pink tags I got from uh, Jennifer's kit. Super cute! And then uh, this part of the lunch bags I turned them all into little t little pockets and so there's a tag in that pocket with another little bow so cute and I love these pink lunch bags of course I had pink lunch bags and then there's um, in the lunch bag pockets I have some um, cute little journaling cards from the paper pad adorbs and then here is another one of the embellishments I created and this one has one of Jennifer's dyed tags and then another sweet little tag I made using um, a little tiny tag um, die that I have and then here's another spot with another cute tag of course it's stickled because you know I had to and then the cute little bear from the paper pad and then here's another pocket that you can put whatever you want in there I made a little tuck spot on this page and it has um, two tags. This one is from the paper pad and this one I cut out of the paper pad with one of my dies. Cute, cute. I just love this paper. I love it. And of course ink the edges of all the paper. Uh, there is a card inside this pocket. This is a paper clip with one of the punch outs from the paper pad. And then over here is another one of the little embellishments I made and it is a tuck spot with two little tags in it. And then a journaling card in this pocket. And then another tuck, tuck spot with two little tags. This one has Silk Sari and this one has the fiber. And then this side has a card in the pocket, a little bow and a little tuck spot with, with one of those dyed tags. I love these bows, can you tell? And here's a paper clip I made from the uh, paper pad, a punch out from the paper pad. And then inside, um, inside this is a tag, but it's like a double tag, so it's both in and outside of the pocket, right? Cute, not bad for my first one, I'd say, but I'd love to know what you think. So please leave me a comment down below and give me a thumbs up. And um, <laughs> this was fun. I might make some more of these because it's too cute. 
So I will see you all on the next one and thanks for watching.